South Boston's fire department needs some more space. The renovations are expected to cost more than a million dollars. 10 News reporter Coulter Ansat explains what's needed and how it will be paid for. The fire trucks and other emergency vehicles at the South Boston Fire Department barely fit inside the building. We're totally out of space and uh, as, as time goes on, the, the trucks themselves get longer, uh, a little bit bigger. Aside from housing the increasingly large vehicles, Fire Chief Steve Phillips says getting them in and out is also a challenge and that creates a safety issue. He would like to have two drive through bays. We could actually bring the trucks around to the back lot and drive through the building rather than backing in off the street. Uh, we've had some near misses out here. Space for the firefighters is also an issue. Currently, the firefighters sleep on the second floor of the building. They have to go down several flights of steps to get to the trucks. That not only takes time, but puts firefighters at risk of falling down the stairs and getting hurt. That's another uh, safety issue that we would definitely take a look at is adding on the uh, sleeping quarters downstairs. All of this, plus the new truck the fire department will need in a couple of years, is expected to cost a little over a million dollars. South Boston Town Manager Tom Robb says which of the fire department's needs will be addressed first has yet to be determined. Last uh, work session we came here to the fire station, we found out what they need. We've been to the police station, we're going to the public works and talk with them. We're also going to the rec department. Luckily, a tax increase may not be needed. We've been fortunate. The, the economy is up. There's no doubt about it, and that helps us. He says that each department's needs will be budgeted for over several years, with at least a million dollars set aside each year. In South Boston, Colter Anstad, 10 News, working for you.